Welcome to my video update on the development progress for the Steam VR simulation of the 1851 Great Exhibition. We start this update with two statues by Bavarian sculptor Ludwig Michael Schwanthaler. Both these pieces are now in the National Museum in Prague. The piece on the right is Libusa, Queen of Bohemia. The piece on the left is King George of Podabradi. Many thanks to Pavel Matusek for scanning these for us. Looking to the east from here, we encounter the huge bronze lion. The lion displayed at the Great Exhibition by Ferdinand Miller is now part of the Quadriga on Munich Siegester. The substitute model here is of a statue outside Leon Cathedral, Nicaragua. Moving slightly west, we encounter a statue of Bohemian Count and Austrian Field Marshal Joseph Radetzky by Anton Dominic Fernkorn. The model here is of a virtually identical work at the Heldenberg Memorial in Kleinwetzdorf, Austria, where Joseph Radetzky is buried. Many thanks to Harold Warneck for allowing us to use his model of this piece. Moving further west we come to Highland Mary by Benjamin Edward Spence, now at the Walker Art Gallery in Liverpool. We must express our thanks to the staff at the Walker Art Gallery who were so helpful when we scanned this piece last week. And finally, for this update, a little further west, is the famous Koei Noor diamond. The octagonal base contains a chub safe. A small door in one of the panels of the base allows access to a mechanism to lower the jewels into the safe at night. The gilded cage is of sufficient diameter to prevent reaching the jewels if one managed to insert one's arm between the bars. Despite the fame of the Koei Noor, it was reported that many visitors were disappointed with its appearance. Later in the exhibition the enclosure was changed to a case lined with black velvet and illuminated with gas lamps, however it still failed to impress. This probably contributed, at least in part, to Prince Albert's decision to have the Koei Noor recut to its current form in 1852. Watch out for my next video, which will continue to add to the contents of the exhibition.